In the annals of classic Hollywood, the name Rochelle Hudson occupies a place that often evokes memories of a bygone era. Yet, amidst the familiar narratives, there exist lesser-known facets of her life that intrigue and add depth to the persona she projected on the silver screen. Are there any anecdotes or facts about Rochelle Hudson that have eluded the spotlight, but nonetheless captivate your curiosity? Beyond the cinematic glamour, Rochelle's journey in the world of entertainment holds untold stories waiting to be unveiled. As we delve into the nuances of her life, one cannot help but wonder about the layers beneath the surface hidden anecdotes that provide a glimpse into the complexities of her career and personal experiences. Speaking of personal experiences, what cherished memories do you hold related to this classic Hollywood actor? Your stories could be the missing pieces that enrich our understanding of Rochelle Hudson beyond the confines of the screen. We invite you to share your memories and reflections in the comments below. Your contribution could be a portal to rediscover the magic she brought to the golden age of cinema. Now, let's unravel the enigma of Rochelle Hudson Toads through exploring the lesser-known aspects that add texture to her legacy. Join us on this journey of discovery and share your thoughts along the way. Rochelle Hudson, known for her roles in notable films, was not only a talented actress but also played an intriguing real-life role in espionage. Prior to the Pearl Harbor attack in 1941, she collaborated with her husband Harold Thompson in undercover work in Mexico. Posing as a vacationing couple, they uncovered hidden supplies of high-test aviation gas, exposing German activity in Baja. Her cinematic legacy is further solidified by four films selected for the National Film Registry by the Library of Congress. She done him wrong, Wild Boys of the Road, Imitation of Life, and Rebel Without a Cause are recognized for their cultural, historical, and aesthetic significance. Tragically, Rochelle Hudson's life came to an end due to pneumonia linked to a liver ailment. Her contributions to both the entertainment industry and wartime efforts mark her as a figure of significance. Green-eyed brunette Rochelle Hudson, a fixture in Los Angeles from 1928, and a film presence since 1930, predominantly portrayed in Ganoos and second leads. Her career spanned several Oscar Best Picture nominees, including She Done Him Wrong, Imitation of Life, and Les Misrables. Beyond her cinematic pursuits, Hudson, after a stint in Hollywood, diverged from the glitz of the entertainment industry. In 1955, she temporarily abandoned Hollywood, opting to run a 10,000-acre ranch in Arizona, followed by a move to Tulsa, Oklahoma, where she found employment in a petroleum refinery. Yearning for California, she returned in 1963, briefly reigniting her career before bidding Hollywood farewell in 1967. Hudson's journey took an unexpected turn as she settled in Palm Desert, achieving success in real estate. However, her life concluded in a Palm Desert Country Club home on January 18, 1972, where she was discovered lifeless by her real estate partner, Walter Price. Her diverse experiences, from the glamour of Hollywood to the solitude of ranch life, paint a nuanced portrait of a woman who navigated the complexities of both the entertainment industry and everyday existence. Wedding bells chimed for Rochelle Hudson four times, each union bringing a different chapter to her life. Her first husband, Harold Thompson, held a prominent role at Disney Studios. Following that, she tied the knot with Dick Irving Highland a sports writer for the Los Angeles Times. Charles Burst, a businessman, became her third husband, and her fourth marriage was to Robert Mindell, a hotel executive. However, none of these journeys down the aisle led to a happily ever after, as all ended in divorce. In 1931, Hudson achieved recognition as a WAMPAS baby star, solidifying her status in the glamorous world of Hollywood. Yet, beyond the silver screen, she honed her craft at the Ernest Belcher Academy in Hollywood, where she took singing and dancing lessons. Interestingly, Ernest Belcher happened to be the father of the renowned dancer Marge Champion. Rochelle Hudson's life was just a series of Hollywood roles. It was a tapestry woven with diverse experiences, from her marriages to her recognition as a WAMPAS baby star, and her dedication to perfecting her skills at the Ernest Belcher Academy. These aspects paint a multifaceted portrait of a woman who navigated both the glitz of Tinseltown and the intricacies of personal pursuits. Rochelle Hudson, born in 1916 according to some sources, had a life marked by intriguing details. 
RKO Pictures, keen on molding her image, allegedly added two years to her age when she entered the scene. This adjustment, however, raises questions about the industry's perception of youth and romance. Beyond the silver screen, Hudson's family background adds another layer. Her father, Ollie Lee Hudson, worked for the State Employment Bureau in Oklahoma and traced his lineage to the famed explorer Henry Hudson. This connection to historical exploration adds depth to Rochelle's personal history. In addition to her acting prowess, Rochelle Hudson's linguistic abilities set her apart. Fluent in both French and Spanish, her language skills opened doors and added a unique dimension to her versatility. The complex interplay between age perception, family roots, and linguistic talents sheds light on the nuanced facets of Rochelle Hudson's life, transcending the glamour of Hollywood. These elements, combined, paint a compelling portrait of an actress who navigated the intricacies of the entertainment world with a rich personal history. From ingenue to leading lady to character actress, Rochelle Hudson's Hollywood journey spanned from the early 30 seconds through the late 60 seconds. Her versatility is evident in the range of roles she undertook, contributing to numerous Oscar Best Picture nominees, including She Done Him Wrong, an imitation of life. Beyond the silver screen, Hudson's life took unexpected turns, from undercover espionage work with her husband before Pearl Harbor to managing a 10,000-acre ranch in Arizona. Married four times, her unions brought varied chapters to her life, each ending in divorce. Despite Hollywood's attempt to shape her image by allegedly adding two years to her age, Rochelle Hudson's personal history includes family ties to explorer Henry Hudson, highlighting a lineage beyond the glitz of Tinseltown. Fluent in both French and Spanish, her linguistic talents added a unique dimension to her versatility. Her story isn't just about Hollywood roles, it's a tapestry woven with diverse experiences, marriages, recognition as a WANPAS baby star in 1931, and dedication to honing her skills at the Ernest Belcher Academy in Hollywood. Rochelle Hudson's life paints a multifaceted portrait of a woman navigating both the glamour of Tinseltown and the intricacies of personal pursuits, leaving an indelible mark on the entertainment world. As we bid adieu to this cinematic journey through the life and artistry of actress Rochelle Hudson, let the curtain fall not on mere nostalgia but on a stage alive with the echoes of her brilliance. As her performances linger in the recesses of our memories, take a moment to unearth your personal connection with this captivating artist. Rochelle Hudson, a tapestry of talent woven into the fabric of classic cinema, leaves us with more than just images on a screen. She becomes a mirror reflecting our own narratives, a silent companion in the dim-lit theaters of our recollections. What scenes resonate with the cadence of your own experiences? Which characters stir the echoes of your own journey? This isn't just a farewell, it's an invitation. An invitation to share the pages of your Rochelle Hudson anthology. Your favorite chapters, the scenes etched in the corridors of your heart, the dialogues that found resonance in the theater of your emotions let them unfold. For in the symphony of shared memories, the magic of Rochelle Hudson finds its encore. As we traverse the landscape of her filmography, each frame, a testament to her craft, let the dialogue extend beyond the confines of the silver screen. Your reflections, musings, and anecdotes about Rochelle Hudson serve as the vibrant hues that paint a richer portrait of her legacy. In the grand theater of life, Rochelle Hudson takes her final bow, yet the encore is in your hands. Share your thoughts, weave your stories, and let her legacy continue to reverberate through the corridors of time. Thank you for embarking on this cinematic odyssey with us, for allowing the magic of Rochelle Hudson to illuminate your screens, and, perhaps, your hearts. Your time, your reflections, are the standing ovation to a career that transcends eras. Until the curtains rise again, relish in the splendor of Rochelle Hudson's indelible mark on the silver screen.